Workers are benefiting from Brexit, according to a prominent leaver, who pointed to a lorry driver who spoke out about receiving a huge pay rise overnight. Paul Embury, a trade unionist and Brexit supporter, took to Twitter to reflect on a lorry driver who received a pay rise overnight. Tom Reddy detailed how he saw his pay rise from £17.50 an hour to £24.50, writing on Twitter, Mr. Embury, who often appears on GB News, highlighted the rise and said, how brilliant it is to see a tighter labour market giving workers real leverage in wage discussions with bosses. Sections of our economy are undergoing a much-needed correction, and workers are benefiting. Former Brexit Party MEP, Belinda de Lucy, also responded. She tweeted, Brexit voters I spoke to up and down the country wanted change to the peanuts they were getting for hard labour jobs, so glad they are finally being rewarded. EU wants to expand with more poor estates and cheap WLD, sick, have kept coming. It's time to back our domestic workforce. The pair were both reflecting on Mr. Reddy who spoke to the BBC's Wake Up to Money programme about the pay rise, but, Mr. Reddy did say he was looking to move jobs, and pointed to his unsociable shifts, Brexit, gender imbalance in the workplace, as well as racism on the road for his reasons for wanting to leave. He said, I've never known anything like it. But they could pay me £80,000 a year and it wouldn't be enough, I want to leave. He added, for many of us, it is hard to get out of, because it doesn't give you the skills other employers want, even though it is a highly skilled job, it comes new visa regulations as a result of Brexit were blamed for the lack of lorry drivers and food processors. According to research by Transport Intelligence, the driver shortage is also affecting mainland Europe, with the shortage to be estimated at around 400,000. The International Road Transport Organization, IRU, predicted a gap of 185,000 drivers by 2027 in Germany. France has also faced a similar crisis with the country facing a shortage of approximately 43,000 drivers since 2019. Queen Margrethe II to bring Karen Blixen's image creating worlds to life in Netflix film.